Coal ash is a very good resource material. It can be advantageously used in concrete works as well as fill applications. This film depicts its use as a fill material for road and rail embankments. But first things first, coal is a major source of energy. In India, about 70% electricity is generated in coal-fired thermal power stations. Indian coal has a very high ash content ranging from 35 to 45 percent. Annual generation of ash in India at present is about 100 million tons. Heavier particles of ash approximately 20 percent collected at the bottom of boiler is called bottom ash. 80 percent ash which is very fine flies with flue gases and collected at electrostatic precipitators is called fly ash. The unutilized bottom ash and fly ash mixed with water to form slurry and disposed of in ash pond is called pond ash. Both bottom ash and pond ash are very useful for filling works such as development of low-lying areas, construction of road rail embankments, reinforced fill, etc. Ash has excellent geotechnical properties which are superior to earth, hitherto used for fill works. Ash from Badapur Thermal Power Station has been successfully used in Noida Greater Noida Express Highway. Moist ash is being excavated from NTPC's Badapur Thermal Power Station for the Express Highway by deploying excavators similar to bulk earth excavations. About 20% moisture available in ash helps to avoid the problems of fugitive ash during transportation. The operation is no different from excavating and transporting earth. Spreading of ash is done by deploying JCB. In case the moisture content in ash at this stage is less than the optimum moisture content, regular water sprinkling is done by deploying water tankers. Compaction is very conveniently achieved as compared to earth since the ash particles are spherical in shape. Regular compaction tests are carried out for density and moisture content at site similar to earthwork, layer by layer. About 20 lakh metric ton pond ash has been used in this express highway from Badapur Thermal Power Station. Top layer of embankment is provided with earth cover to avoid problem of fugitive ash. We spoke to Mr. S.S. Raju, Joint General Manager, IRCON. Noida Greater Noida Expressway is 24 km long, connecting Noida at MIT International School to the Gulf Coast at Greater Noida. Due to its inherent characteristics, the fly ash can be used in the embankment because it has got high drain facility, high permeability, and higher CBR value compared to the soil, angle of internal friction is higher and easy to compact. Even in the monsoon we can carry out the work because of its higher, higher achievement of the OMC in the shorter time and you, you can use the same compaction equipment what is being used for the uh, soil. Thus, you can save this time in the construction and as cost also as it is available at free of cost from the nearby Parma Station, which are at around 25 km distance. Besides the use of ash as fill material for embankments, it is also excellent material for reinforced fill material in flyovers. The requirement of reinforced fill material comes in flyover work, where there is space limitation for construction of retaining wall. Ash serves as excellent reinforced fill material. 
Pond ash from Badapul Thermal Pass Station is being used in Sarita Vihar flyover approach road as reinforced fill material. Geogrid is laid on the embankment and ash is dumped over it and regular ash spreading, water sprinkling and compaction is done as in the case of earth. Sarita Vihar flyover is being constructed by Messrs. Gemon India Limited. We spoke to Mr. Hegde from Gemon India Limited about his views on use of fly ash in road work. Uh, in the Sarita Vihar flyover, flyover for the reinforced earth portion, we have been using the fly ash. The fly ash has been extensively utilized here up to the quantity of 8,000 cubic meter. The fly ash is a very good material for the embankments. Uh, it, has, it has got a very good draining uh, property. That's one of the reasons we have gone in. It's quite fast, happy that we have gone for it. It's very good for us. Delhi Metro Rail Corporation has utilized more than 12 lakh metric ton of ash from NTPCs and DVBs thermal power stations. It is because of various advantages of using ash in place of soil such as easy and faster compaction, possibility of work even during rainy season, assured availability. Delhi Metro Rail Corporation was able to complete the work involving 9 meter filling in an environment friendly manner within the scheduled time. Ministry of Environment and Forest has also issued directives through Gazette notification dated 14 September 1999 to CPWD, PWDs, Development Authorities, Housing Boards, National Highway Authority of India and other construction agencies including private sector to prescribe the use of ash in their respective schedules and specifications. Indian Road Congress and Bureau of Indian Standards have issued guidelines for use of ash in road embankments. Its use also saves the precious topsoil for agricultural purposes. As you have just seen, the freely available ash is an excellent material for filling works for road, rail embankments and as reinforced fill material and is becoming more and more popular day by day in construction industry.